All oh, right, okay, here's one that um, could be a bit sensitive, but we can work with that. I have a very overweight teenage son. I'm worth it, working with him to address how he, uh, he eats and what he thinks about exercise, but he hates sport and he hates the idea of being forced to do anything. However, and she does stipulate this, it says from his mum, um, he is aware this is an issue that has to be addressed. Okay, so how to approach this. Um, well done for already having the conversation with your son. I didn't say here how old he is, by the way, whether he's 12 or 13, or maybe he's the higher end of his teenage years, uh, 17, 18, 19. But you've already had that conversation, and he's already aware that, yes, he does need to make some changes for his own health and longevity. However, he hates exercise, and he really would enjoy anything that he thinks he would have to do. So there's a few things to think about when you approach this. First off, is his negative approach and feeling towards exercise based on previous experience to this point? Has he been made to feel uncomfortable perhaps with uh, exercise and sports at school because he feels like he stands out too much, he doesn't enjoy it and all that kind of stuff? Or is he just a little bit, like a previous question, a little bit intimidated by the fitness environment? So there's a few ways that we could approach this. My first recommendation would be um, speak to him again about the idea of doing something uh, as a family. Where, where it may be a case of you start going for a walk, you start going to the beach, I don't know where you live, maybe you start going to the beach and walking up and down the sand for a little bit. Just take a dog for a walk if you've got one and get him involved. If you've got family friends of a similar age or younger siblings or family members, maybe get him into an environment where he's playing with them so it feels less like prescribed exercise. Um, you might find that I've had this with clients in the past, uh, teenagers that are overweight, that it's the relationship to their health and fitness experience being linked to their family that is the the problem because your son may find that with the best one in the world you're a loving mother but he feels like you're behind him pushing him into this situation that you need to do this i'm worried this is for your own best interest i want you to address this and he feels reluctant to get started maybe he feels a little bit bullied maybe he feels like if he doesn't do it as well as he perhaps could and doesn't achieve what you think he should he's going to be letting you down. He feels bad about that. He feels bad about his own situation anyway, if he's aware he's, he's overweight. So what I would suggest is, like I said, think about maybe doing something as a family that's not prescribed exercise. Um, but then also, again, go from past personal experience with clients of mine, ask him what kind of thing he would like to do that's more active. What kind of um, sports or activities does he find appealing or would he... Um, like to do that maybe he doesn't have the confidence to do and look around where you live your community for someone who's got a club or a, who or teaches something that's related to that that he could enjoy speak to them uh, without him present and say hi my son's a bit shy he's got these issues can I introduce him to you and maybe think about enrolling him or assigning you up as an instructor because then he's got a third party someone that he can speak to that doesn't feel like it's part of his home environment that he can go along to and go hi how are you doing and he can just be brought out of himself a little bit and start to appreciate the benefits of exercise without mom and dad or family members around him because he doesn't feel like there's pressure around that whole topic. Okay, so I hope that's helpful. P please, please pursue it because if he's already aware of the situation, then work with him. It may be a slow process because he may feel a little bit uh, down on himself. He may feel a little bit shy, but I wish you the best of luck with that. I hope that's been helpful. Okay, so find an outside influence. Try and do more things together as a family that will just get him more active. Um, I would suggest that with all this, you don't also bombard him with the concept of a diet at the same time because we're talking just drastic changes. He'll feel a lot of pressure and he will just feel put upon. Don't do that. If anything, when it comes to food and nutrition, if that's a significant issue as well, just start implementing healthier family meal times, And that's it. Don't worry about calorie counting. Don't worry about going, we're eating like this now as a family because of you. Because again, you'll feel pressure upon that topic. Just maybe change what food's available in the home environment, where you maybe you go for snacks now and again, or if you're out as a family. Just start to make positive, broad changes so he doesn't feel like he's the topic that everyone looks at when they think about exercise, fitness, everything else. Because like I said, it may ruffle his feathers a little bit. It may make him feel a little bit down on himself. So best of luck with that. I hope that might help. Hi, thanks for watching this clip. If you enjoyed this content, click here to watch the full unedited version of this episode.